Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try the new Jax Links um, little bowl meals. This one is the nacho chicken. It's seasoned chicken with rib meat, nacho cheese sauce, and Spanish style rice. And it says heat and eat. These were at Walmart for $2.50 and they're, uh, they were in the refrigerated like meal section. So, so yeah. So this is what it looks like. Uh, calorie wise, it's really small variety. Um, 260 calories uh, for the container. Lots of ingredients. I mean, wow, it's a lot of ingredients. So heating it, um, we're gonna peel the lid. It doesn't say remove it, it just says peel it. One minute and 30 seconds and stir and then let it sit for a minute. So I'll peel it, but I don't know if you'll be able to see. Oh, I see some cheese or something in there. Yeah, that's all I can see. So I might get this in the microwave. Um, what else is this? Uh, yeah, just general information. So anyway, I'm gonna get in the microwave and I'll be back. Okay, here it is at the microwave, and it's funny, it almost uh, popped and flipped over at one point in time. It like turned on its side and then fell back, so it's, yeah, got to be careful. Um, I did not put a plate under it, although I did have to wipe uh, a little bit of cheese off the bottom of the microwave. So you may want to put a paper plate underneath it just to uh, contain any popping and spillage. So looks pretty decent. Um, I see some black beans in there. So uh, I'll stir it up better once I, um, once I put the camera down, but it looks pretty good. smells good. So I'm gonna let this set for a minute like it says, and then I'll be back. Okay, it's had a little time to cool off. So here's the bite I'm gonna take. It has uh, a black bean and some chicken and rice. Plenty of cheese, there's cheese everywhere, so. Spicier than I was expecting. Um, I mean, it's not like not like eating jalapeno peppers, but it is, it's got some spice in the back of your throat. The cheese is a little strange. First of all, the chicken and the rice are cooked really well. The beans aren't hard, which I like. They're, they're soft. The chicken feels good and tender. It's not a tough or dry. Um, my, my only problem with is, uh, well, I've got two things. The cheese is kind of a graininess. This has a graininess to it. <coughs> that uh, I, just, I can't tell if I like it or not. The texture is a little weird. The flavors are okay. It's just the texture is weird. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, the other thing is the spices kind of overrule it. So <coughs> some of my throat caught my throat. Um, the flavors are okay. It tastes like um, a spicy nacho uh, dish, like a bowl. The chicken's good. Like I said, the the rice, you really can't get the rice. I think the rice is more filler than anything. I don't think there's a lot of flavor. Mostly you get the spice flavor and the cheese flavor. So, but the bad thing is the cheese kind of has a processed cheese kind of flavor, which is not necessarily the best thing in the world. Um, and it's very tiny. Look how tiny that little pot is. It's not very big. So uh, for $2.50, price is not horrible, I guess. The calories are a little higher than I would have expected for this small thing of rice, basically, and cheese. But there's a lot of cheese in here. Then, unfortunately, the cheese kind of tastes like cheap cheese. So I'm going to give this one a three. It's just an average everyday thing. If you really like that nacho cheese flavor, you might want to try it out. But for me, I think I would pass on it. So I wouldn't get another one. So anyway, I hope you enjoy this video, and thanks for watching.